Hey, welcome back everyone. I'm Ishan Sharma and I want to quickly make this video because there is something really amazing. Okay, there is an amazing opportunity that all of you should take a look at. It is called as the Google Step Internship, especially for first and second year students in college. If you are interested in technology, software development and you want to get an internship at uh, Google, then you should definitely watch this video completely. I got to know about this uh, opportunity by Khushbu Goyal's video, so a uh, huge shout out to her. But in today's video, we'll be taking a look at exactly how you can apply, step by step process, what all do you need to do. Uh, make sure that you watch this video completely and share this video with your friends. The last date to apply is today, so make sure that you go uh, to the link in description and apply over there, alright? So yeah, let's get started with this video. All right, so you simply just need to go on Google, just search for Google Step Internship in India and you will get this careers uh, link from Google itself. Just open it up. This, uh, as you can see, stands for Student Training in Engineering Program, uh, Step Intern 2021. This is for 2021, uh, March and April. You can take a look at this. It's like a 10 to 12 week internship. Yeah, over here, you can take a look at this. May and August 2021. Uh, exact dates are not yet available, but basically, you will be working under Google as an intern, okay? And for this, for you to be eligible, you need to be in a college, obviously, and you need to have a programming skills in C++ or Java or Python, and you have to be free because this is going to be a full-time internship role. Uh, and this is really good because if you are a second year student, this would really help out a lot in your resume, okay? So you should definitely take a look at this particular uh, job opening or like internship opening, you can call it. I think that this is really amazing because this would really shine on your resume. This would set you apart that you got an internship from Google as a second year student. Uh, I think this is really good. If you have been coding from first year itself, you might be able to you know, uh, get this particular internship. Let me just open up the application uh, and show you exactly how that works. All right, so basically what happens here, you need to upload your resume. Uh, if you are in second year, just make up your resume using your LinkedIn profile. Uh, that's what I did it, at least. Uh, and just enter your name, your address, basic stuff, phone number, website. You need to have a portfolio website, right? That, that's really important. Always make sure you have a website in which you can just show what all you have done, okay? And uh, then just enter whatever work experience you have. If you don't have, that is also completely fine. What college do you belong to? Just enter that. That would be really amazing. And uh, if you have a cover letter, that's good, but it's completely optional. Uh, regarding the resume, just make sure that you show off whatever you have built. Okay. Talk about the numbers. The numbers are what uh, speak about themselves. Okay. Don't just lie around saying that I have had huge impact on something. Be specific, okay? Tell about what all you have created and how it has helped other people. I'll show you what my resume looks like right now. And as you can see, this is what my resume looks like. Uh, it basically has some summary about what all I've done. Uh, you know, as I've written over here, you can see uh, whatever I've done. I run a YouTube channel. I, ha I teach Python programming on an academy and I've all made all these projects. I've participated in hackathons. All of these things you can mention, whatever projects you've built and how that has helped other people, then just put down your experience that is relevant, okay? I have other experience as well, like I've done freelancing, but that's not relevant to a software developer role. Uh, just enter what is relevant, just make it, uh, and then make sure that your resume is short, okay? I would say a one-page resume is best, but uh, I just uploaded this two-page resume, I think it's, it's going to be fine. Uh, and just write down whatever certificates you have, if you have any, <laughs> okay? And I think that, that should be pretty much it. Uh, this is just a two page simple resume that you can just make and that would pretty much be it. Make sure that you mention your LinkedIn profile as well as your, uh, your emails so that they can contact you. Regarding the stipend, yes, you will be paid. I don't know the exact amount. Uh, I have seen some answers on Quora in which they say in US they pay around like $45 per hour, but they would adjust it for the, uh, you know, money purchasing, what do you call it? purchasing power parity, right, triple P. And based on that, you will be awarded whatever, uh, you know, amount is suitable, but it is going to be paid. So that's a great thing. And you will get to learn a lot from it. Okay, this is a great opportunity. Everyone should apply for this. I will leave this particular link in the description. So all of you can apply for this. Also, I would like to thank uh, Khushbu for letting me know about this uh, internship. She made this video pretty quick. Uh, and I just thought it would be great for me to also make a video just sharing that this is a great opportunity for all of you to take a look at. All right. Thank you all for uh, joining for this video. Make sure that you share this video with your friends. This is very important. Today is the last day to apply. Go apply. See if you can uh, 
uh, get this internship and if you do get one let me know in the comments or you can also reach out to me on instagram but yeah make sure that you have a good resume and also you need to submit your transcript that is how many marks have you gotten in your in your college okay so your last semester grades just submit that and that should be enough okay thank you all for watching and i'll see you in the next video Bye bye